Hi guys, my name is Ferdy and in this video series I will show you how you can work with all the Elementor Pro elements. In this video we will take a look at the Woo products element. If you want to get Elementor Pro then click on the link below in the description. And if you buy Elementor Pro through my affiliate link, you don't pay more, but I get a commission, so thank you for that. If you want to see the result of all the Elementor Pro elements, then go to elementor2018.com and go to the page Elementor Pro. Here I will show you all the elements, so let's get started. Let's go to the Pro elements, to Woo products, over here. I drag it in a new section. What you will see? You'll see one product. Well, I have more products over here, so I'm not sure what's going wrong. I can have one column, but I want to choose four columns. And the product count, I could say eight. And I don't know why, but now I see them. So that's weird. I hope uh, Elementor will fix this. I have six products and you will see them all. But what I want to do, I want to count only four. So you can choose a column, the amount of columns for and the amount of products. And now I only see one. And if I go to query, I can select them based on the author or the category. Services. And I see all my services. Merchandise. So what I can do in order to fix this problem is add all the categories. Sometimes you have to work around things. So that works. You can also choose them manually. So I can search for them USB, Skype, hoodie, shirt. And then I can say, you know what? three columns and you can filter them by feature sale you can order them by title descending or ascending you can also exclude things but since we selected our own products that's unnecessary and that's actually all there is so if you want to show a few products and you want to choose them manually then you can use the WooCommerce product element here we can increase the margin, 20 pixels. And if I save it, and I take a look at the page, it looks like that. You can read more, or you can add them to the card, view the card, and then you can proceed to the checkout. Thank you for watching this tutorial. Please like this video, subscribe if you want to have more videos, and then I will see you next time. I wish you the best. Bye-bye.